All right, we're back with more Assassin's Creed 2. Um, we, last time we picked up the Assassin's outfit from a chest in our dad's uh, house in a secret room. Delivered a letter to this guy that he had been talking with before. Mysterious character in a robe has behind him. Don't know who that was. And uh, the whole thing just seems kind of sketchy. So we are going to move on see what's going on here we'll we'll see about like what pops up on the way to mission checkpoints uh though i don't know that i'm gonna necessarily do a 100 percent playthrough uh kind of just interested in checking out some of the gameplay and story elements uh we got a guy over here so i'm not entirely sure how that's gonna go for me in the way of like these courier missions all the feathers and um, what are some of the other stuff? The races. It probably might not be bad, but with so many games, uh, I'm recording these here right at the end of September, and there's so many games. I like right now. I'd love to play Gundam Versus when it comes out, but I've got so much on my plate. I don't know that I'm going to do that, and I've already invested in so many games. I don't know that I have the money that I should. So, it's all uh. God very up in the air and iffy in the way of my gameplay um because i've got dragon's dogma pre-ordered that i'm going to check out when that comes out let's see was there a sink spot anywhere nearby it's over here let's go grab that actually i kind of that's one thing i might go out of my way for here and there oh dear um let's go up Um, so, what was I saying? Ah, yeah, Dragon's Dogma is pre-ordered, and I, I want to check that out and be able to do that. Um, and that's like the 6th of October or something like that. Um, oh yeah, that's that one we saw before that I said, ugh, let's wait. <laughs> hmm. Is there an enemy over there? But we should otherwise... Be okay to start finding our way. I don't know the best way to climb up here. Let's see. Because there's not really any handholds it looks like. There is on this building maybe? Not there. Let's see. And then I was kind of thinking of doing a Observer. Uh, it's kind of a horror game. Um, darn, not really any. You're looking like you wanna. Let's let's shimmy on over here. Maybe we can get maybe we can get something out of this. Um, you know, kind of in the spirit of October and horror games. Maybe check that out. But I'm I'm still not a hundred percent on that. Best way to get to this spot. I am, uh. I just want up there. So maybe I just have to climb up the right side. Ah, come on. You know you wanna. Aww. Oh. Um, you see nothing. You see nothing. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, oh. I just want the sink. That's all I want. I want to sink up. That's it. I don't even know how this one works. Like, how are you supposed to even get to that? Well, that was worthless. I'm, I'm gonna move on. Cause, yeah, that didn't work out like I planned. Let's see, what else? We got Comrades, Final Fantasy XV Comrades coming out. Um, 
the last day of October, so I'm gonna have that really. <laughs> um, that I'm working on. Then what else? Um, November will roll around. We'll have Assassin's Creed Origins. There we go. And then episode Ignis in December, and then there's three games. And Jay, I don't know why they're doing this to me. Monster Hunter Origins, uh, Nino Kuni 2, and The City of Final Fantasy all come out like within two weeks of each other in January, at the end of January. So that's attend the acquittal, which is right over here, I guess. Somehow I feel like there's not an acquittal. Auditore, you and your accomplices stand accused of the crime of treason. Have you any evidence to counter this charge? Wait. The documents that were delivered to you last night. Yeah, I just realized. Oh my god. Yeah, I told you. Sketchy. He's lying. Need to get closer. This is that bad feeling any compelling evidence to the contrary, coming true. I am bound to pronounce you guilty. You and your collaborators are hereby sentenced. Do that little sick kid. You are a traitor, Roberto, and one of them. You may take our lives this day, but we will have yours in return. I swear we will. Father! Hey! Grab the boy! He's one of them! I'll kill you for what you've done! Guards! Arrest him! Oh dear! How about that, dude? Better run, boy. Fast! I'm cool with that! Running is in my blood! Oh, that was not what I meant to do, but that's all right. Whew. The pain of betrayal. Yeah, pain indeed. Memory se sequence complete. Does that mean we're going back? Yeah, we're heading back. Whoa. Press L3 to switch to first person camera. I think they said that one before. Oh, we're not going back into present day, we're just kind of I've switching memories. For you. I've identified several strange markings that I've discovered right across Renaissance Italy. Now, I don't know what they're doing there but I want you to help me find out. Rebecca has marked their general location in the database with an eye icon, and she's made them glow as well. Keep an eye out. Why would I want to do what a bastard like you says? It's a dick. Serezio, thank God. I've been looking everywhere for you. I couldn't stop them, Annette. I tried, I swear. But there were so many guards. Please, come with me. We need to get you off the streets. What of my mother and sister? They're safe. I'll bring you to them. No. It's too dangerous for us to travel together. Tell me where to go and I'll meet you there. My sister's house. Just north of the Duomo. I'm on my way. Okay. Uh, you are now notorious. Guards are on high alert. Oh crap. Uh, yeah, yeah, okay, 
Try to avoid the guards. Use the SSI to anticipate their reaction. SSI. What was SSI? Real useful vision by fixing the viewpoints. Yeah, we're gonna reiterate everything we kinda know. Okay. Is this a viewpoint that I've hit up? No. I, I don't think they appear on the map unless I haven't. Oh, that's that same freaking one. I'm gonna have to like figure out how to do that. I honestly don't know. Like, I don't know where they want me. I guess maybe I just have to shimmy around the building. Yep, excuse me for me coming through. Uh, let's see what we can do here. Let's see if we can't be a proper assassin and stick to the shadows here. gonna recognize me just by walking by? Do I need to be like in a group of people? We're just gonna go up and over then. to mess up my run here, jump off buildings again, because I'm just fantastic at that. How much further? I'm not really keeping my eye out for extras and stuff like that. What is that? Is that like a side quest? Is it on the map? I guess not, because I haven't unlocked the area. What's the symbol above it? I don't know what that means. There's a uh, sink point over there. Let's hit that up. Uh-oh. Well, I am. Thank you. Does not like me going up certain sides here. All right, let's get this. Maybe that'll tell me what that is. I guess I could just always go over and see what it was. But hello, eagle. So yeah, stuff is going south real fast. Let's see if that kind of tells me what, what the heck was going on over there. I guess not. So, I'm not even sure I remember what direction it was in. Kind of back that way. What is that? Oh, that, that's painful. But that's my destination, right? Wait, that is what's up here. You must have your kaka sangue moving like that. What is this? Connecting? That's one of the symbols. What does it mean? Oh. It must be there for a reason. Can you take a closer look? Hey, try using eagle vision. Oh my god. 
I hate yes, him. That's not possible. This can't be. Hold on. That's computer code. Let me compile it. Oh, shit. It's an encrypted file. Upload it to my computer. I'm a master at decryption. Yeah, I can't. It's only compatible with the Animus itself. What? Upload it to Desmond then. I believe this. I really don't like that guy. What is going? What? Hello. This is. They, they, they call me Subject Sixteen. Listen, I don't have much time. There's something I have to show you. We have been lied to this whole time. Everything we know, everything we've been brought up to believe, it's wrong. Okay, um, I've uploaded the evidence, the file that, 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 that proves it all, but I've split it into 20 pieces and lock each with a code. <laughs> Can't be too careful. Qu Queen Isabella. No, not her. Uh, 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 what century is it? Uh, never mind. I've hidden the code to the first file inside this program. <sighs> um. Find it. Find them all. And along the way... Is this a side thing? What the heck? How did this get inside our animus? Oh. Oh, the memory core. We transferred 16's memory data from Abstergo into the Animus 2.0. He must have hacked the machine when Vidic left him alone between sessions. Oh, hold on, wait a second. The signs on the walls in Abstergo, the ones written in blood, those were clues. He was telling us to look for them inside the Animus. Um... Five of these mythic scenes share a core similarity. Pick them out and you'll begin to see. Uh, Cupid and Psyche? Or five of these scenes share a core similarity. Core. Similarity. Uh-huh. What? Can I get this wrong? Birth of Venus. Core similarity. That maybe, and then yeah, okay. So core and pick are highlighted. So I'm thinking whatever has these freaking apples in them. So there's two, three. This, 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 this. Two, four, five, six, eight. Press X to enter the passcode. File unlocked. All right. Whoa, there's a lot of these. The truce. Play. 
so we we're only getting like a little a little snippet there just trying to see what that uh, was but uh, I guess we have to find more to f kind of put it put it together okay so I mean I guess that's all we can do for now uh, are those marked then he said on our map or no like that didn't pop up as a thing on the map did it we just kind of have to happen to cross those we gotta make sure we're, we're checking stuff out with this eco vision why are those glowing Oh, it's a hiding spot. Oh, that's nifty. So, and I don't know where those one guys went from before that I was curious about. So, oh, there they are. That's them, right? Yep. Well, it's the best way to get over there. Because I feel like if I jump, I'm going to miss. Did I actually do that right this time? Well, let's find out what's going on over here. And I guess they're not... What a skilled earth! Access database. I bet those thieves can work with you to distract the guards, and if you start a brawl, they'll probably fight with you. Just go talk to them, and they'll tell you their price. Okay. So. Alright, yeah. Let's see if we can see anything else from over here, though. Right now, I got nothing. All right. Moving like the wind. We are going to. That's enough distraction, I guess. I mean, since I'm not doing any side stuff, I figure I won't mind if I check some of that out. <laughs> but yeah, all right. So that was an interesting little uh, puzzle bit there with the truth, and it uh, looks like potentially an optional thing. So. Like, I'll have to, uh, he does not want to get down off of that. There you go. Good boy. So, I'll, I'll try to keep my eye out for those. I'm glad I went up there and checked that out, because that was pretty cool, actually. Mind finishing whatever that is. I think we have the wrong building. Yeah. No, this is it. It is a pleasure to make your acquaintance, Messer Ezio. Annetta speaks quite highly of you. I can see why. I appreciate the kind words, Madonna. Ti prego. Call me Paola. Thank you for offering your home to my family, Paola. It was the least I could do. You must be tired. Perhaps you'd... No, grazie. I can't stay. Why? Where are you going? To kill Uberto Alberti. I understand your desire for vengeance. But the Gonfaloniere is a powerful man. You are not a killer, Ezio. Not yet! But I can make you one. Why are you going to teach me how to kill? I'm not. I'm going to teach you how to survive. Come. Can't kill if you're dead. It makes sense. Learn the ways of the courtesans. Fitting in. Right oh. Discretion is paramount in my profession. We must walk the streets freely. Seen but unseen. Alright, we're gonna check this database entry. 
Those girls are definitely available for hire, but you can use them as moving cover. In fact, try sending them to tempt unwanted guards. Huh. Prostitution was one of the most popular occupations for Renaissance women whose only other options in most cases were staying with their families or living in a convent. Italian society supported prostitution and many brothels were regulated by the government. At the end of the 15th century, cities started to pass laws against prostitution, forcing courtesans to wear specific outfits uh, and separating them from respected society. You two must learn to blend like us and become one with the city's crowds. Okay. My girls will show you how. This is Paola. 1438. Okay. There isn't much information about Paola in the history books, but the Florentine archives reveal that she was orphaned at age eight when her parents were killed at sea. Left with a choice between joining a nunnery and prostitution, she began a life on the streets. At 16, she vanishes from the records only to reappear at age 20 when she was arrested for murdering a city guard. On an interesting note, Giovanni Auditore represented her in court, winning the case on a self-defense plea. Released from prison, Paola went on to start her own brothel to protect many other unfortunate women of the street. Okay, so, uh, she wants you me to You can what? practice with me anytime. Uh, yeah, okay. So am I supposed to, uh... Oh, yeah. You like what you see? Oh, okay. You can blend with groups of moving civilians. Follow Paola. Blend to become invisible to guards. Alright. Blend by sitting on a bench with civilians. Uh, I'm, might take me a minute to get a hang at the blending thing. Is uh, not gonna work. Oh! <laughs> All right. Well. Hmm. Sorry, I didn't have much. To, uh. Wait. What did I say? We must walk the streets freely, seen and unseen. You two must learn to blend like us. And become one with the city's crowds. There's something I did wrong there. I, I mean, I know I punched him, and that was like, because I just, but, hmm. Again, like I said, sorry I got a little bit quiet, because uh, I was trying to concentrate there. Uh, it wants me to follow her, but I also have to blend. I can't tip off the guards. I guess I don't have to stick right to her. I mean, as long as I don't get too far away from her, I shouldn't have a problem. So I can sit on benches to blend. So yeah, so I use the crowds like that to kind of... Oh, come here guys. I want to blend me. Okay, 
Where's Paola? Okay, there's no guards this way, so hopefully we're kind of toward the end of this. I think I started to go the wrong direction as part of what that was. Man, it's so crowded. There's not any guards around, so hopefully we're done. Ah, uh, where are we going? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now that you've learned to blend, I'll show you how to use it for more than just moving around. Okay. Let's teach you how to steal. Nice. Hold X and walk into someone to steal from them. Are you going to make me do this so with you? Does it matter who I do it? Once you've stolen from someone, Ezio, you mustn't linger. Help! Somebody stop it! Guards! Help! There's a thief about! Hurry away after stealing to avoid being caught. <laughs> Steal from five different people. Two, or that's one now. There we go. Fitting in. Let me just kind of, I don't know what's going on here. I don't know if I need to let it die down first. We'll just kind of... Okay. I, I'm realizing how quiet I am right now, and it's like awful, but... There we go. You can go now, girls. Oh, do we have <clears> to? <throat> so, you listen. Cute. <laughs> But it's got me concentrating real hard trying to, to figure out, make sure I do it right. We need to find you a suitable weapon. What would you have me use? Ah, but you already have the answer. Hey, my father's blade and bracer. How did you get them? <laughs> How did you not know that was gone? Not exactly in working condition. I assume you're familiar with Leonardo da Vinci. Oh, yeah. How does a painter factor into this? He's far more than that. He's an inventor. You'll see. He's gonna fix my blade. 
One last question, if I may. Of course. Why have you given your aid so readily to me, stranger? Whoa. I too know betrayal. He up my sleeve. Visit Leonardo da Vinci at his workshop to see if he can repair Giovanni's blade. Yes, please. Hidden blade. So I can do some stealth kills. Hiring groups. Uh-huh. Giving orders. Uh, press L2 to lock on to an enemy. Okay, right now I don't need them though. Oh, right, right, right. So I can, uh, So this is this will work. I don't know why I don't just go over the rooftops, but we'll we'll do this the Assassin's Creed way. to uh we're gonna do this my way we can dandy about all we want but in the end it's not like they're usually up here on the roof but he is Woo. Oh, that hurts. Actually, this might work out. Why would anyone carry on like that? Because I'm weird. Let's see if we can get past these guards. Or this one guard, it looks like. Oh yeah, I'm just a people, moving along with other people, just off to see, uh, you know, Leonardo da Vinci so I can stab you with blades. Uh oh. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Would you work? Oh crap, it's not working. Oh, that's a freaking guard right there. Hold on. Hello! I'm blended. It's cool. Nothing to see here, folks. good. It's all good. Oh lord. Alright. 
I just gotta make it over there. We're all good. Nothing to see here. So I didn't do anything. You keep walking. There we go. Oh, crap. go blending in you see nothing Ooh, there's a scout spot up here we are gonna hit this up Oh hey, we need we need that stuff. That's one of them spots, isn't it? Oh crap! I forgot to step down before I tried to hit evil vision there. I'm gonna do that every time now, apparently. different things happening here. Hold on. Oops. Okay. So is that nothing? What is this? Oh crap. Feather. Have you been drinking? Yeah. Might be. I saw a few different things. Well. Hiding spot. People, uh, yeah, I guess I'm not, ah, hmm, keep trying to, uh, hit, <laughs> circle to get out of that. Get to Leonardo da Vinci here so we can fix this hidden blade. Oh, Ezio Auditore! I, I didn't expect to see you again. What with all that's happened? Ah, where are my manners? Welcome back. Uh, now, how can yeah. I have service? I was hoping you could repair something of mine. Of course! Come, this way. You must be joke. Let me clear a space. All right, let's see it. I don't know, Ezio. Despite its age, the construction is rather advanced. I've never seen anything quite like it. I'm afraid there's not much I can do without the original plans. Mi dispiace. Wait, wait, wait. What are you doing? The contents of this page are encrypted. But if my theory is correct, based on these sketches, it may very well... It may very well what? Please, sit. 
It doesn't jump it back and forth. Yeah, I'm the same way. It's like, please just spit it out. There, it's finished. Huh? What's finished? The blade. I managed to decode that parchment of yours. It showed me exactly what to do. Now all that's left is to remove your ring finger. Really? I'm sorry, but this is how it must be done. The blade is designed to ensure the commitment of whoever wields it. Bene. Do it quickly. Are you kidding me? <laughs> I was only having fun, Ezio. Though the blade once required a sacrifice, it's been modified. You can keep your finger. Oh, wait! Ah! Uh, I think I heard about some of that with Origins, like... Yeah. So... Like the old days, you had to commit. So hidden blade is up, sword was right, fist of cuffs is down. All right. Incredible. Yes, it is. Tell me, do you have other pages like this? I'm sorry, only the one. Listen, if you ever do happen across another one of these, please bring it to me. You have my word. And thank you for fixing this. It By order of the Florentine Guard, open this door! Uh, just a moment. Wait here. Are you Leonardo da Vinci? Si. How may I be of service? I need you to answer some questions. Certainly. Conspiracies! What seems to be the trouble? A witness claims to have seen you consorting with an enemy of the city. Nah. Me? Consorting? Preposterous. When was the last time you saw or spoke with Ezio Auditore? Who? Non fare il finto tonto. We know you were close with the family. Perhaps this will help to clear your head. <sighs> Ready to talk? What about now? Huh. Assassinate the guard. Oh yeah, end. buddy. Oh yeah. What about now? How do I assassinate? How do I do it? Press square for a low profile kill or hold R2 and press square for a high profile. Ready to talk. We'll go low profile. Yes. Grazie, Ezio. Sorry about that. Uh, I've grown accustomed to their abuses. Uh, he's just what like, meh. Bring it Par for the course. The others. others? The city gives them to me for research. Uh, okay. We're gonna loot. And then we'll just kind of... And nothing to see here, folks. Over there. See, <laughs> it never happened. Thank you, Leonardo. For everything. Anytime. And remember, if you find more of those strange pages, bring them to me. Should they contain new designs, I will upgrade your blade as well. Of course. Okay, cool. Now, I really should be getting back to Paola. Are those going to be obvious or missable? Because that would be great. Ace up my sleeve is done. Should be a checkpoint autosave thing. Got the hidden blade, assassination skill. And we are ready to move along. You can use a hidden blade to fight. Or I can use my sword. Right? Or do I not have the sword anymore? Mm -hmm. Sword's not popping up, so I guess we'll just go with the hidden blade. Did they take my sword? They must have taken my sword. I'm trying to remember this. Alright. But that's long enough for one day. Um, went a little bit longer and lost one. I was, I'm trying to keep it just a little bit shorter and watchable, but that's alright. Um, I also want good stopping points, so yeah.
and that makes a good one. So we will continue forward with the next time with being a better assassin. So we're, we're little by little, we're making it there. Thanks for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time.